I don't, you know, that's, that's why, like, sometimes when I look at homeless people, because everybody just wants to get the fuck out, and nobody, you know, you just don't want to work. And every once in a while, you look at, like, these fucking bums. And I don't mean, like, people, like, tra- something tragic happened to them. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, like, some sinkhole swallowed up their fucking home, and then they didn't have sinkhole insurance, and so now they're fucking, you know, sleeping at a bus station. I don't mean those people. I mean the bums. The old school hobos. The guys out there riding the fucking railroads. Right? With a stick with a handkerchief around it and a little peanut butter and fluff another sandwich inside of it. Those guys, they got to figure it out. They always feel how I feel right now. You know why? Because they never have to go to work. It's always over. It's always over. And then, you know, what do you do? You go to a new town. You wash some dishes. Next thing you know, you know, you're eating beans over a fire outside, you know, eating them with a knife or some shit. You know, is that how they used to do it? Or is that just what the actors used to do in those old movies? Trying to make an interesting choice. I'm going to eat with my knife. Maybe that'll make me the next John Wayne. Um, yeah, they have it fucking figured out. You never done that? You never just walk down the street in the middle of the day, in the middle of your fucking stressful day, you're coming back from lunch wondering mentally, how the fuck am I going to get through the next four, four and a half fucking hours? And you just walk by and you see some homeless guy just fucking just napping, laying on a park bench or even on the sidewalk and just so fucking sprawled out and just in such a deep level of sleep it, it actually looks appealing for half a second, you know? I'd love to interview one of those people. And just be like, who won the Super Bowl this year? Just to see how out of the loop they are, slash how big are sports, you know? Do you know who Tiger Woods is? Do you know what happened to him? You know? Are you aware that we're at war right now, Still? Where were you when it started? Were you behind a desk? Were you normal? You know? Did you have a suit? Did you sit there and laugh at jokes that you didn't think were funny, but just doing it to try to get to the next level fucking cubicle? Is that what you did? At what point did you just decide, fuck this? I want to take a nap when I want to nap. Can you imagine if you were allowed to nap whenever you wanted to nap, how much better the world would be? You could just be at work and just be like, hey, you know what? I'm going to go lay down for about fucking 20 minutes. And just go over and curl up in a fucking ball. And that'll be it. You know? What I'm trying to say, people, is I'm very excited. As much as I enjoy writing these fucking things, it's just great that, uh, you know, I'm looking at my dog right now. Just fucking chilling out. Just fucking laying there. She's laying there. She's, she, I don't even know why she's tired fucking tired from all your goddamn sleep and i'm jealous of you cleo cleo nothing she knows i'm talking about her but she doesn't give a shit she's fucking tapped out she's laying on the rug there's a little bit of sun spilling in from the window and she picked the sunny warm part of the rug and that is it that's all the fuck she needs you know no upward mobility she's not working on her next fucking season of uh you know fucking the real pit bulls of the greater Los Angeles area. She doesn't give a fuck. She's got nothing on her agenda every day. It's fucking tremendous. Maybe that's why their lives are only 10 to 15 years. You know, they just get to live like all, you know, because when you look at your whole life, if you're lucky, you get 10 to 15 years total of just bliss. And the rest of it, you know, is just dealing with some cunt with coffee breath telling you you didn't have enough, you didn't bring the right fucking forms. You got to go back home and go get something else and stand in line again. That's, that's what the rest of your life is like. But if you're lucky, 10 to 15 fucking years of it, you know, you get to live like my dog right now, taking a nap on the sunny part of the rug. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, there's so much shit going on right now. Like, 